Hi there and welcome to this bite-sized video on how to set up your simulator software so that you can see which ringer you are following and also where possible where you can identify that you're following the treble. So we have our two simulator softwares that we're going to look at, Virtual Belfry and Able. If we look at Able first, you probably will know by now that on the moving ringer screen, there are a set of uh, numbers above each ringer, and these are used to identify how well you're striking, uh, your scores at the end of a, uh, a touch, and it can also be used to highlight the bell that you are to follow next. And you set this up by using this option, highlight ringer to follow. And when you set that and you start ringing, as soon as you make your first uh, stroke, then you'll find that the bell you want to follow uh, will be highlighted above the ringer in yellow. So if we just ring rounds now, after I've uh, press the J key once, uh, you'll find that the two will light up with a yellow indicator band at the top here. And if we go into the method, go. No. Plain hunt. Okay, if we just stop it there, you could see that the yellow bar was flashing above the ringer that we needed to follow. Now in Able, there is no specific setting to follow the treble, so you need to be watching for the yellow highlight at the, above the, uh, the treble ringer whilst you're ringing, and that will tell you when you're following the treble. If we now look at Virtual Belfry, things are a little bit different. In Virtual Belfry, when you have the uh, ropes display, we have all of your ringers. You'll see down at the bottom here, there is a tab that says ropes. As If you go to the blue line, that tab becomes blue line. But we want the ropes tab. If we click on that, we will find a, an option here for rope sight flashes. And we can turn on the rope side flashes. And then we can also then check the option for flash when following the treble. If we now look at that in action, go plain hunt. You saw then that you were following the treble and you got the yellow flash on the treble. There you go again. That's all. Stand. There are also options in Virtual Belfry for directional colours, which will mean that it will flash cyan or a magenta color, depending on which way you're going with, you're going up to the back or down to the front. And there is also an option when you're out of place by a certain percentage of a blow, it will give you uh, a hint of where you need to go and you can set that on this slider here. So if you are two thirds out, it will actually flash to show you where you should be. So that's how to set up rope sight flashes in both virtual belfry and able. Very useful tool if people are particularly if they're looking to see when they pass the treble. I hope that's been useful and we look forward to seeing you again very soon. Thanks for watching.